Hi everyone, I'm Jen Sheffer, Instructional Technology Specialist at Burlington High School, and this is a quick tutorial on how to use the iPad app ThingLink. So I'm going to start by opening the app, and it will immediately take me to my camera roll. And ThingLink is a way to create interactive images. So my ThingLink is going to be based on JFK. So I'm going to quickly show you how to add a couple pieces of media and make this an interactive image. So I'm going to start by um, adding text and now. I can either add text, URL, or um, something from Twitter, but I'm actually going to add a URL to a YouTube video, which I've already selected. So I'm going to head over into uh, that YouTube video that I want to insert into the thing link and I'm going to hit the share button and copy the link and then go back into the app and paste the URL of the YouTube video into the thing link and uh, this red button appears and this is called a touch so there's my first touch and I'm gonna just go ahead and add one more and this is going to be a URL to a article from NPR and I'm going to copy the URL for this article and go back into the app and then paste the link to the article there and as a teacher or a student I would repeat that process for all the different pieces of media that I wanted to add so um, this could be used as a way to create an interactive homework assignment or it could be used by your students um, to do um, an, inter an interactive presentation as an alternative um, to PowerPoint or a Google presentation or whatever they may be using. Um, once I'm done and I'm satisfied with the amount of touches that I have inserted into my image I can simply click next and now I can save it and I'm going to just um, title it JFK. Um, if I don't want to put it on ThingLink, I can unlist it, but I'm just going to keep it uh, listed publicly on um, ThingLink.com. And I'm going to save it and it gets added to my library and you can see I've made several other ThingLinks. Um, once it's done, I just want to show you what it's going to look like. Um, you'll see my touchets appear here on my iPad um, and then they slowly disappear. So if you look at the image it looks like it's just a plain old picture but as soon as you touch it there are the buttons um, and I'm going to just turn my volume down a little bit because the YouTube video will actually play um, on the iPad and can see here, or you can hear it. Vice President Johnson, Mr. Speaker, Mr. Chief Justice. So there's um, Kennedy's inaugural address embedded right into um, my my image and then as I mentioned the second piece of media I added to this thing link was the article from NPR and I can open that and I just wanted to show this because the audio file from the article is also included so um, students could either read the article or they could listen to it and it will play right um, again from the iPad. It ought to be possible in short for every American to enjoy the privileges of being American without regard to his race or his color. This so, as I mentioned, um, this could be used in a lot of different creative ways in the classroom, um, whether it be for homework or um, a quiz or a test. Um, so, if you have any questions and you'd like some help um, from me or any of the Help Desk students, feel free to come down and, and visit with us and we'd be happy to get you started uh, with ThingLink or we can come into your classroom and get your students started um, using this um, 
really fun app. So thanks for watching.